with CMIBeach.com. And if you know anything about our organization, you know that we support people that do good things for the community. So today we are out at the Beach Sweep. They do this every other Saturday. And let's go check it out. beach.com and right now we are at a cleanup hosted by the beach and we have numerous organizations i'm here with Nadia and can you tell us a little bit about your organization sure nice to meet you all i'm noelia from heal the planet we are a non-profit organization and our mission is to educate children and adults about the environmental sustainability, wellness, and nutrition. We are based in Fort Lauderdale. We have different programs that support the community. One is at Snyder Park, and we also teach in schools a program called SEED. And it's all about nutrition and supporting the community to stay eco-friendly, and obviously wellness is one of the biggest things in our nonprofit. Cool. And what does SEED stand for? Uh, C is a sustainable energy education, and we have uh, a school program that is six hour total. So we can do one hour a week, we come to the school, or we also do online classes, and there is again about sustainability, wellness, nutrition, um, and one of the big things for our uh, organization is the power of choice. We teach kids about how big choice makes an impact in our planet. And if someone wanted to um, help with your organization, how could they get in touch with you? Well, they can get in touch with me uh, with my email, noelia at healtheplanet.com. That's N-O-E-L-I-A at healtheplanet.com. They can also visit our website, www.healtheplanet.com. Awesome. Thank, well, thank you. you so much. Thank you for what My you do. Pleasure. I've seen your signs around here at your sign and your building and everything. Yeah, so we're, we're trying to spread the word. We nice. want people to be aware of what we're doing. Well, we're going to help you because we think it's a great organization awesome. and Barry said good things about you. All right, Audrina, let's go around and check everything out. All right, let's do it. Thank you. Bye-bye. Bye. Bye. Thank bye. you. Bye. come out the uh, second Saturday of every month. We are 501c3 in partners with the City of Fort Lauderdale. We get up to 300 volunteers picking up 10,000 cigarette butts in a three hour period, 100 pounds of trash, 30 pounds of recyclables, a couple hundred straws. We need the support. We would love to be put out of business by not having cigarettes on the beach and any of this trash. Please put us out of business. <laughs> That's wonderful. Uh, why, when, how long ago did you start this? We started it uh, five years ago. We incubated it. Uh, when we, first time we had 50 people, we couldn't believe it. We had 100, we were dancing. And now pretty consistently, as we're building it back up, we get up with the 300 people the uh, second Saturday of every month from eight in the morning until 11. And uh, it's a beautiful, come on, it's a beautiful place to be. Look at this. Exactly. Even on, even on days like this, it's still beautiful. It is. Yep, and uh, we have corporate uh, team building people come out here. We have high school football teams come out here. Uh, the firemen come out here. Everybody helps. It's all the community. And the city's involved too, right? Right. Explain we're partners with the city. We, we're partners with the city of Fort Lauderdale through the uh, community service office with George Hershka. That's out of the uh, city manager's office. They support us. The city council. We've gotten certificates of appreciation. The mayor supports us, and the hotels support us. And uh, we just do this great work, and people love coming out here. And we are so fortunate to, to live here, to do this. Wonderful. Thank you very much. Barry. Thank you. Appreciate Thank you, Barry. Thank you. Air high five, my friend. Boom. Take care, buddy. Let's go out and do the beach. All right. My name is PJ, like you said, and uh, I work at Lens Financial. We're a new mortgage lender uh, right here in Fort Lauderdale. And um, one of the things that we wanted to do was become a sustainable mortgage lender. So we want to be doing more activities like this beach cleanup and as much as we can to give back to the community and um, you know just do anything sustainable that we can. We want to start doing some initiatives for uh, green housing and absolutely everything just to give back to the community and, and do a great job with you know anything sustainable we want to be 
be involved in. God, is this your first cleanup that you've participated in? Yeah, this is our first one, um, and we're just looking forward to doing some more. Wonderful. Yeah. And how many volunteers did you bring out today? Um, I want to say we have between 20 and 30 volunteers. That's wonderful. Yeah. Fabulous. Awesome. Yeah, we, we, th we think businesses should begin with a, with the, the purpose of giving back to the community, so that's a great purpose on there, so we really like that. Yeah. yeah. Anyway, well, thanks for being out here, guys. We're going to catch some of your people on camera and everything. Fantastic. And uh, okay. air high five? Air high five. All right. <laughs> Take care, guys. Talk All to right. you later. Appreciate it. Thank you it. much. Little buckets are going to be for cigarette butts only. Big buckets are going to be for everything else. You're only picking buckets. So as you heard Barry say, cigarette butts are one of the biggest problems on the beach. So what I'm doing is kind of sifting around in the sand to see if I can't find any. Seagulls over here. Hey everyone, I'm here with Dave at the Beach Sweep, and tell us why you volunteered. Eh? So, I've been volunteering my entire life. I think it's really important to give back to our community, the people who live here in Fort Lauderdale. We're lucky enough to have this beach around us, 365. We come here all the time to use it personally, and it's important to give back and help clean up. Unfortunately, we get a lot of visitors. People don't know how to clean up after themselves, and it takes a community to go and help and, and make it a beautiful place for everyone to come and enjoy. Great, and how long have you been part of this organization? I've been part of this organization about five years now. Um, it's amazing the, the people that we meet that get to come out every morning on beautiful days like this and help do this, but five years straight. Wonderful. It's awesome, Dave. Well, thank you so much. Thank you. Air high five. Absolutely. All right. That was a connection. <laughs> All right, guys, go. take care. Ardina, let's go around. Hey guys, Rick with SeeMyBeach.com. We're out here today at the Beach Sweep Cleanup in Fort Lauderdale, Florida. And uh, I've got a few people I want to talk to here. What's your first name, young lady? Um, my first name is Julieta. Nice. What's yours? Camila. And what's yours? Luca. All right. So tell me what you what you guys are doing out here. Well, we're actually picking up trash. Um, and bugs. And the, yeah, and bugs and okay. things like that. Because when the turtles come, they or come jellyfish. Again. Yeah, and jellyfish. They come and um, they like always like let's say they're laying their eggs and some sometimes when we find fish, people get the fish and there's like plastic in them. So we're just trying to help out the animals. In the ocean. That's awesome. So that's why you want to give up your Saturday, which man, Saturday's special for kids. And you're coming out here instead of doing that, you're gonna come out here and clean litter, huh? Yeah. That I is awesome. Oh, look at you, man! You're catching all kinds of stuff out there, huh? What kind of stuff did you find out on the beach today? I saw the Uh-huh. Well, she tried to chase me and attack me. I found yeah. cigarettes and things like that. Cigarette butts. You'll find cigarette butts everywhere. Yeah. Never smoke. It's dumb and it causes a lot of problems for the environment. Yeah. You, get, you, you actually pay to kill yourself when you smoke. Yeah. <laughs> it's pretty stupid. Anyway, everybody. All right, everybody, say bye to the camera. Bye. Say bye. I'm really proud of you kids for doing this. Let's all do an air high five. All right, all right. All right, thank you guys. And what are you doing with that camera? I am filming you. I'm filming you. What do you think I'm doing? <laughs> all right. Don't be so shy next time, okay? All right, guys, we're about to close this out here with Barry from Beach Sweep and Audrina. Barry, this was an amazing day, man. Thanks for coming out. In fact, really, it's all about the volunteers coming out, supporting us, and cleaning Fort Lauderdale Beach. It's wonderful to see these people, and they have a good time doing it. Absolutely. It's a we, win for everybody. Absolutely. Audrina, what do you think about the people we talked to today? Oh, I think everyone uh, had a really good time, and they're making a huge impact, so wonderful. And we're leaving in just a few minutes here. People are literally, it's getting close to the close time. People are still signing up to come out and clean a little bit themselves, yeah. so that's inspiring to see. So thank you for what you're doing, Barry. Thank, thank you for you. being on camera for us today, Audrina. Absolutely. She came in all the way from the Florida Keys just to do this. Thank you. Because You're amazing. My pleasure. Because we, 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 to make a difference in the world, we have to go all out and do what we got to do. So Organizations have to get together. That's right. We have, we actually have three different organizations here working together because there is no competition when it comes to cleaning litter. That's right. all we want. All have to do our part. All right, guys, take care, and we'll talk to you later. Thank you. Right here on Fort Lauderdale Beach, Fort Lauderdale, Florida.